Hey guys, how you doing? VT Meister here. Hope all is well. Well, this is update number two on the Sense Home Energy Monitor. It's been about six weeks since I posted my last video and uh, I'm pretty excited to show you what's happened and uh, actually pretty pleased with things so far. Uh, and let's go ahead and take a look here at uh, some of the numbers and so forth. All right, guys, so let's go ahead and take a look at the uh, Sense app right now. As you can see, I'm using about 1.7 kilowatts at this moment in time. And that's mostly because of the uh, heat pump, which is running in our house for the uh, living room to heat the uh, main part of our house. Also, the hot water heat pump compressor has turned on. That's actually a new device that was discovered as of uh, recently. The name of the game here is being patient. Uh, just in the last couple of weeks, Sense has gone ahead and discovered a number of devices, mostly motors and a couple of new devices. So I'm very pleased about that. Went about a month with Sense not really doing anything new, but in the last couple of weeks, Sense has really upped their game. So let's go ahead and take a look at some of these devices. And as you can see here, um, a lot of the range, uh, electric range, was discovered, as well as a few other things here. And I'll show you all these unnamed heat devices and motors. My goal, hopefully this coming week, will be to uh, start figuring out what these devices are. I figured out a few things, and I suspect that uh, motor 13 and motor 14 have to do with our heat pump. One device that I'm really excited about that was just discovered uh, in the last couple of days, and I figured out what it was, is our master bedroom closet lights. So in our master bedroom closet, we have two uh, lights that are wired together and there's two LED lamps within each light and together it takes 74 watts and there's a lot of light in that closet it's a full walk-in closet so I was able to figure out that when I turned the lights on and off this was actually the actual new device that was discovered by Sense and what's exciting about this is this is the first set of lights in the house that Sense has discovered and uh, it's under 100 watts so Pretty excited that some of the lights are being discovered. So this is going to be a short video here. Many new devices have been discovered, and I'm excited about that. The name of the game here, as I said before, is being patient and allowing Sense to do its work. It's really upped its game in the last couple of weeks of fine devices. So one thing I did notice in the last month, and I haven't noticed it in the last couple of weeks, is that devices in the same range of uh, being one kilowatt would show up and be mislabeled. For example, my wife would turn on the hair dryer, which is about 1100 watts, and it would say that the coffee maker turned on. But I haven't noticed that that much in the last couple of weeks here. And let's just go ahead and take a look at uh, the uh, trends here this week and so forth. Um, and you can see the unknown devices right now are, is uh, taking up approximately 66.5% of the energy. That's actually down from the unknown devices as of a month ago. It was closer to 80%, so pleased with that. All right, guys, so this is going to be a, a short video. I'm going to wrap things up here. I've had a lot of quests to do an update video, and uh, I said I was probably going to do it in week number two or three, and uh, it just happens that uh, it took a little bit longer here. But I'll do another update video when I uh, pass the next set of hurdles here and when Sense really uh, makes another big leap here forward, which it has done in the last couple weeks here. So thanks for watching. I do appreciate uh, you taking the time to check out my channel, check out Sense here. Uh, I'm really enjoying this device. And I'm really glad I'm able to uh, share this data with you and uh, if it helped you get a sense or lead you in the right direction for uh, home energy efficiency and your projects, uh, that's, that's a good thing. All right, thanks for watching, and uh, you know what to do. Like, subscribe, leave a comment, and we'll catch you next time.